Hey guys, it's Mr. EJ's Tech here, and today I've got a video just going over the uh, iOS 6 jailbreak status. Uh, so one of the uh, most frequent questions I get is, when's the iOS 6 jailbreak coming out? When can I jailbreak my iPhone 5? Stuff like that. Uh, so I just wanted to clarify a few things, and I also haven't been able to make a video very lately, uh, just because uh, school has been uh, I've been very busy with school. And uh, the other thing is that since there is no jailbreak, I don't make tweak videos just because a lot of the tweaks are, aren't very good. And the fact that the iOS 6 jailbreak isn't very good, nor it's uh, it's also non-existent for most of the devices that people have. Uh, so that's the reason why I don't make a lot of videos right now because one, I'm busy and two, uh, the jailbreak is kind of out. Uh, so the past few days, I've just been thinking about what I can do for a video when I get spare time. Uh, I decided to do a jailbreak status video uh, just to let you guys know about that. Uh, but yeah, so uh, if you want to see anything else, do let me know uh, your video ideas. I did get a Blue Yeti microphone, by the way, uh, in case you uh, didn't pick that up. Uh, that's why I wanted to do a video today. I uh, just wanted to test out the microphone and uh, stuff like that. Uh, so uh, basically, the current status of the iPhone uh, 5 jailbreak, or all the new devices, so A5 uh, processor and up. If you don't know, that includes the iPad 2, iPad 3, iPad 4 which is just a processor update and a lightning connector. Uh, so there is an iPad 4. A lot of people uh, mistake that. And that also includes the iPad mini, iPhone 4S. Uh, so that's quite a bit of devices. That's a lot of the devices that everyone has. Uh, at least people have iPad 2s. And I, oh, I also forgot iPod Touch 5. Yes, iPod Touch 5 as well. Uh, I don't think I forgot any. No, no, I didn't forget any. Uh, but anyways, uh, so though all those devices can't be jailbroken because there is no uh, exploit for the new firmware. Uh, so on uh, 5.1.1, the only device was, that was jailbreakable, or only devices, was the iPhone 4S, iPad 3, and iPad 2. So the iPhone 5 and iPad Touch 4 and iPad Mini haven't seen a jailbreak, and uh, probably won't see a jailbreak for quite a while, uh, if you want my honest uh, speculation. Uh, but anyways, the current status is that there is an iPhone 4, there is an iPod Touch 4, and a 3GS jailbreak. Uh, so that is on 6.0 or 6.0.1 Tether, and that's through Red Snow. If you want information, that's down in the uh, crotch. Uh, but anyways, uh, so that is tethered. It's honestly not a very good jailbreak. That's one of the reasons why I don't make videos. It's very slow, it's sluggish, um, not too impressed with it. Uh, plus, there's no good tweaks coming out lately, because uh, one, there's no one to really sell to or people to download. And then, uh, yeah, so there really hasn't been any good tweaks lately. Uh, I, I, the only device I have jailbroken is my uh, iPod Touch 4 right here. Uh, my iPhone 4s are on uh, <laughs> 6.0. Uh, so really, uh, there isn't really any good jailbreak uh, stuff right now. Uh, hopefully we can see the iPhone 5 jailbreak, but the problem is it doesn't seem like there's any inspiration uh, for that jailbreak. We've seen that Posenix Ninja, uh, he's not exactly working on the jailbreak specifically. He's looking to dump the boot ROM of the A5 to A6. That'll lead to a jailbreak, uh, but specifically he's not looking for direct uh, jailbreak. He's looking for being able to dump the boot ROM. Uh, so uh, that's kind of like, yes, good, uh, but it doesn't seem like he's cra like crazy working on it. Uh, so uh, I, I don't mean to offend him or anything, but it doesn't seem like it's a primary uh, objective. And then we also saw that CH Pwn, uh, he actually went ahead and jailbroke the iPhone 5 on the first day. Uh, but really, that exploit's been around for quite a while. It's it's honestly just a developer. Uh, if you have a developer account and you have, it's something that allows it to execute over USB. It's, it's really just a, it's a jailbreak, yes, and it's great, but you can't do anything with it. It cannot be released, uh, it cannot be mass released because everyone would need a developer account. And then Apple would get mad because it uses pre-release stuff and all that good stuff. Uh, so, yes, that would not work. Um, so, the jailbreak is not very practical. Uh, so, basically, what he showed off is like, yes, I can jailbreak. Yes, I got the only jailbroken iPhone 5. Uh, of course, uh, his colleagues might have a jailbreak. But uh, he's, he's like the only one who has the iPhone 5 jailbreak. And uh, that one really doesn't go anywhere. That doesn't really help except for... Uh, testing some tweaks that are really non-existent. So, uh, yeah, so uh, the iPhone 5 jailbreak is not very promising. Hopefully we can see some inspiration. Someone 
someone maybe even new uh, come up with a jailbreak, there has been a lot of fake stuff. So someone who wants attention and they say, oh, I have a jailbreak, and then they make some cheesy video on YouTube. Uh, so you, you should watch out for that. Uh, and uh, yeah, so basically the current status is that the jailbreak for iOS 6 and 6.0.1, the jailbreak is for the iPhone 4, iPod Touch 4, and iPhone 3GS. Uh, so that's only for that. It's tethered. And uh, basically, every time you turn it off, you have to go ahead and uh, connect to the computer. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.